so in this video we are going to implement the filter function for our table uh, so whenever a user enters uh, a text we would like to filter out the department table okay so let's let's start implementing this so we need a text box to be able to do that <coughs> So let's say mat form field. So inside that, let's have an input material style input auto complete equal to off or false. Okay, off, which basically means that we don't want to show any suggestions. I guess we can keep it. I think that's not a problem. So mat input. So we have function on key up. Okay, this function gets executed whenever the user types in any <coughs> value inside the text box. So on <coughs> each key enter, we're gonna call the function which is called as apply filter. Okay, so what does the function contain? We're gonna pass the event dot target dot value so basically we are just passing the input whatever the user has typed okay <clears throat> and then finally something called placeholder it's the text that uh, displays within the text box i mean the the name of the text box right so i think that's it so let's see if that thing works there so we'll click on uh, departments okay mat form field <clears throat> so it's supposed to be mat input so we'll click on departments so we can see we have a filter option so you can basically type so what i'm trying to say is every time whenever <coughs> user enters a text we have to execute a function right so when i say if he types f it has to execute the function and filter the table and uh, show the results immediately. <coughs> so we're gonna execute. We're gonna start writing the function apply filter. So let's copy this and let's write function. So apply filter. It is expecting uh, a filter value, which is of the type string. And what happens when this function executes? We are gonna say this dot list data dot filter equal to filter value whatever we send the text filter value dot trim <coughs> dot to lowercase. So let's see if that thing works <clears throat> so let me simply type uh, finance so if I type F the function executes and finance gets written right so let me type I T okay so this is how it works if you want to do a filter based on department ID let's say I want to filter department ID by 4 so it immediately executes the function and filters out the table.